What a beautiful morning. And so secluded out here in the upper peninsula, Bobcat Lake. Look at all the birch trees laying on the ground. Amazing. I think one of the things I love about the forest is being able to look at it and see the timeline, see what's happened. And what's happened is this tree, look at that, it looks like a a planter that someone would hollow out. See that? It's been laying there. It's full of dirt now because so many things have died and fallen into the the trunk, the remainder of the trunk. I wonder if it split and it was, yeah, see there's a root over there. Okay, so it was growing there and it fell down three, four, five hundred years ago. How long has this been here, you know? On top of it. And look, it's just totally decomposed right into the soil, but it's probably kind of mushy if you walk on it. Yeah, just keeps going up. Look at that, and the moss grows on where it fell. We could be talking a thousand years ago. That's what fascinates me, is the continuity of the timeline of the forest. It just keeps going, and it's the cycle. I guess that's what I'm trying to say, the cycle of birth. Look at all, look at all those pines. Must have been from the same pine cone. Boom, 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 boom. And the birches, something's killing them. Not all of them, but they're not, they're not growing new ones here is what I'm saying. Maybe it's the transition of the boreal forest. I just don't have a good handle on, on what's normal and what's logged over and regrowing. These hemlocks are beautiful. Look at that. And this is white cedar, the spindly one being shaded by the hemlocks. But you can see the, the foliage on that. They're evergreens. I'm going to do some fishing today and exploring like I'm doing now. And I just, I just love it. I love it. You know, i got a great balance between pedaling and exploring on foot. I'm going to stay here at Bobcat Lake a while. Oh, look at that red squirrel. They're such acrobats. Look at that That's a red squirrel over here yelling at me. And this one hated his warning and stopped being an acrobat. Wait, no, he's up in the tree. There he goes. Zoom in, Dougie. Wow, nice jump. I guess he's, he's wise to my presence. Sometimes you come into an area and they just scold you. Like that one is doing. They sort of rattle. 